Hey everybody, welcome back to the movies. Uh, we just came back from the 1930 awards ceremony um, and swept the awards, so... Um, I think the first plan of action here is to give everybody some makeovers. Um, since it is 1930, um, that seems pretty logical. Um, Tina, we want to keep her happy. She's number one star. Um, it looks like... Uh, this 30s dress too is best for her. Um, I will make it white. Uh, we'll give her a bracelet, a watch, um, a ring. Yeah, she's pretty in pink. It's like Molly Ringwalk. She liked that. Let's get bacon burger. Um, let's see what he likes. 30s waistcoat. Okay, that's fine. How about, uh, let's give him a black waistcoat. Uh, trousers, black trousers. Let's give him a hat. Yeah, I think he had a bird. I like this one, the derby. He looks even creepier with this. <laughs> <laughs> that can be Bacon Burger's new look for the 30s. Uh, he's alright with that. Uh, Kirsty, uh, yeah, she, no, she's no longer going to wear her Space Slave uniform. Um, let's give her the 30s dress one. Um, the top, yellow. What about the bottom? dress. Eek. Ugh. Ugh. Oh, those are hideous. Well, how about this? Yellow top, green dress, purple belt. There you go, Kirsty. Yes. I have no fashion sense. Okay, Josie Pussycat. What does she like? Let's give her the 30s dress, too. Um... Tina was in pink, so let's give her a different color dress. Um, um, let's give her this blue dress. Blue with white? Uh, yeah, that's okay. And that'll be Josie Pussycat. So, uh, oh, we need to hire Patrick Martin, wherever he is. Let's find Patrick. And let's make him an actor. And let's bring him into the uh, makeover department. So, Patrick needs a name, so if anybody wants to name him. Uh, let's see, jacket. Two choices, pinstripes or solid black. Um, we'll let him be solid black. He needs some hair. Um, you know, that's not bad. I mean, he's looking better. A little goatee. He doesn't look as stupid as he did before. Yeah, so Patrick Martin needs a name, so if anybody wants to... Just leave it in the comments if you have a name for him. Uh, he's probably going to want some more money. Yeah, that's usually how it goes. We don't need to pay him a lot just because he's... He's not that vital. Um, he's going to want a trailer too at some point. Uh, let's get Kirsty and Patrick talking. Let's get Tina and Josie talking as well. They're already friends, uh, but they're, since they're going to make movies together, we might as well have them talk. Uh, because we're making three-star movies now, we're going to need more crew members, so I'm going to hire that person there. Um... Oh, movies are a fad which won't last. People want the stage. They want real I'll life. Hire this in front guy. Of them. Movies will never replicate reality. You see. Okay. Our 
Archive. Kirsty. Patrick. Tina. Josie. Okay. All right, so we're going to write a movie now. Um, and this is going to take quite a while. It's going to take me at least five minutes probably to do this. So I'm going to just fast forward. I'll, I'll do this uh, off camera and I'll bring you back uh, when I'm done. Because it's going to be nine scenes long and it's going to be really boring. So um, I'll see you in a little bit. All right, we're back. Uh, I wrote a movie. It's got nine scenes in it. It's called French Fry Frenzy. It's a comedy. Uh, so we can go ahead and start uh, rehearsing that. Yeah, so there's three crew members in there now. Um, but we've got Tina as the lead. Uh, we've got Josie now as a supporting role. Um, and we've got Bacon Burger as the director. So that's pretty much how the movies are going to roll from from now on with those those three in them. Uh, keep Kirsty and Patrick talking. They need to get to know each other. Nice dress, Kirsty. It's it's an upgrade from the space slave costume, but it is hideous. Look at this guy back here. He's a scriptwriter. Uh, he'll probably be entourage before too long. Maya Woods and Emma Putak still. Alright, let's get this movie going. Okay, let's pull over our crew. So we've got the two A-team crew still on the A-team, but one of the B-team crew now, Stephanie Smallwood, is is now on the A-team. Right, let's get Tina. Let's get Josie. And let's get Bacon Bird. Okay. All right. So, let's. What we need to do now is make Patrick Martin a trailer. Um. It's a wrap. Thank you. Trailer rickety. I don't think these are gonna last much longer. And without further ado, I'd like you to hear another gramophone recording of some remarkable music. Okay. Let's put some grass down. Okay, so Patrick Martin will be all set up. <laughs> Look at this. Tina Peterson's a, a robot. Uh. Action! <laughs> yeah, you're like, what and did he just write? Yeah. It's a wrap. Thank you. Okay, let's get Kirsty back over here with Patrick. Okay, we got a suburban bathroom, so that's good. So we have a new set. Um, let me pause real quick and build that. Um, so we have it for our next uh, movie. This is a little guy. Um, anywhere else we can throw it? And put it right there. It's fine. Put a little bit of grass around it. 
and unpause. Okay, so one thing that I did with this movie that I wrote, it's that's nine scenes, is I wrote all the scenes for the bank right back to back. So the, there's six scenes here on the bank, uh, and then once they're done with May those... May I have your attention, please? A new pack is available for research in the lab. So w once they're done with these scenes here on the bank, they're all going to move over to the Wild West Saloon. Um, whereas if the script writers were writing the, the movie script, they'd write a scene on the bank, then they'd move it over to a different set, then they'd move it back over to the bank, then over I'm to a different set, and they keep everybody moving around, and it wastes time. So when I write it's movies, a wrap. Thank you. I keep them all on the same set You're for as long as I can. William Macduff, coming to a wireless near you, courtesy of the miracle of radio transmission. And it is a miracle. We don't fully understand it here at KMBS. I'd like these guys to be friends, but it really doesn't matter that much, to be honest, because um, their movies aren't going to be very good anyways. But um, since I'm just going to make a short movie, um, I'll, I'll uh, just stay uh, recording here. Uh, Dance and Fever, yeah, that's fine. It's uh, Patrick Martin is the star. We'll put it in the musty cellar. It's got 55% novelty. Um, let's do a uh, enter carry. Let's do... Uh, read book. I don't know. We might have to change something here. No, we got a full star. That's fine. Okay, so that'll be for Patrick and Kirsty, but I'd like to get them to be friends. Nope. Hey, hearts and rainbows. Yeah, see, I like he looks a lot better with his goatee, his hair, and uh, glasses. He really likes her dress. He's like, I like your dress a lot. She's like, thank you. What are you doing? Crew. All right. Okay, how's our movie going? Oops. Oops. <laughs> the mouse is really, really sensitive, so... And action! Sometimes you click Good on things news. you don't mean KMVS, to. KMVS, the wireless station you're listening to, is having a telephone device installed soon. So, if you have and one, cut. you may use it to contact us and discuss the events of the day. It's a wrap. Thank you. Okay, Kirsty and Patrick are friends now, which is good. So let's bring Patrick over and give him his trailer. He doesn't get a car. So let's start filming Dancing Fever. May I have your attention, please? A new pack is available for research in the lab. Okay, so I must have had a supporting role uh, that normally I would just have an extra do it. Um, let's let Iran Titley be the extra in, in the movie. I like her. Action! 
Maybe she'll show up, Patrick Martin. And and cut. Okay, one more scene it's a wrap. in the Thank bank, you. and then they're moving to the saloon. Shall we have a scary story now? One stormy night a few years ago, I turned on an electric light. There was a bing, and the light stopped working. Nobody had touched it, and the glass was intact, but the filament had been broken by forces unknown. Okay, well, I'm going to go ahead and pause the game here. Um, I was about to build a, the new living room set, but my timer went off. So um, so if anyone has a name for Patrick Martin, feel free to leave it in the comments, uh, and uh, we'll go ahead and get him his new name. Um, but again, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next episode.